Good morning, David. It's Bobby. I uh, drove out here to Holiday, Florida to uh, do the video for you on the Regal. I did a complete walkthrough. I'm just going to show you a quick video on uh, on the boat so you can see she's a very nice boat. I'm glad I made the drive. Um, definitely everything uh, they say she was. All right, so we'll start around the, the outside of the boat. So she's white with a gray hull and a navy blue, navy blue uh, bootstripe and a white hull bottom. No bottom paint. Um, I did a complete walk around. I didn't see any, any major scratches or scuffs or anything like that. Uh, so you can tell the boat was well cared for. Has a stainless steel anchor with the stainless steel anchor chute. It's equipped with a windlass, which I'll show you uh, once I get up on top of the boat. I tested most systems um, just to do like kind of like a pre-survey and really didn't find anything that didn't work. So. Uh, Think we're good on that end here we are at the hall number the last two digits there as you see uh 2021 you know, let's see if you can see the angle but it's 21 you got the nice gray on gray um sea decking twin 300 uh yamahas uh white with the gray lower units you got three underwater lights so you got one off the center and one on each side. Those are Bennett trim tabs. You got the extended swim platform, dual shore power connections, and that is your uh, water inlet, I'm pretty sure, to run uh, dock water to the boat. Uh, you can't tell, the, I don't think the boat has ever slept in the water because there's no corrosion that I see. That's just grease and stuff, but uh, good. No major scuffs or anything on the skegs. They're all in intact, props have no dings there's currently 68 hours on the engines and 30 hours on the generator here's your swim, swim ladder we'll jump on board and we'll continue on the top side so the boat has a pretty extensive uh sound system it's all fusion uh, subwoofer speakers all over the place so here's two he added uh, five rod holders off the back. That is your uh, um, wash down hose. Just pulls out, goes in. It's a remote control for the fusion. That's just a vent. All the upholstery looks good. No rips, no tears. I'll close this. Here's your um, seat that folds out. Now I'll go ahead and put that away. Live bait well with the pump. Side dive door. Back here we have uh, your battery switches are below, storage, like little storage compartments, isotherm refrigerator, a trash compartment. You got a freshwater wash down electric grill, Samsung uh, flat panel TV, more speakers on the on the hard top with LED uh, spotlights. Making our way forward. You have another wash down hose there, some rod storage. Moving our way forward. We'll start up here. Here's your anchor windlass. All right, where you can control it from the helm and you can also control it through that, that black switch there, okay? Storage and storage. Uh, there they have some ropes and some covers for this area. So that's all stored away there. I'll stand up here to show you. You got a, looks like they installed a nice light bar and then you have the Garmin radar dome, which I tested and it works perfectly. And I think they're gonna remove it for the transport to the water. Oh, also under here is the stainless steel pole that screws in there in order to put the teak table that the boat has that goes here. So we'll make our way back. Also, there's a windshield vent, more fusion speakers. You got the Yeti cooler. You got the teak pad so you can get a get it. A little bit more elevated at the helm. So 
So I do have the radar running for you. This is your GPS. We'll scroll through here. Um, you have the sounder fish finder. And you also have, um, what is it? You got the gauges, you got the Yamaha gauges here. Okay. It'll show you all the, all the information we need. Okay. Oh, we gotta have that key on. There we go. So we got the hours. So there's your hours, 68, 68. All the information is there. You can also get it through here okay 68 and 68 all right you got the bow thruster control here you got the joystick electronic uh, throttle and shift that is your uh, joystick panel that is your Bennett trim tabs little glove compartment armrests your Garmin VHF, got all your switches, tested all the switches here, everything's good. Every seat comes with an armrest, you get another armrest there and you got another one right here. So my way, make our way down to the cabin. It smells like new down here. Oh, gotta put this away. So basically here you have uh, the forward bench, I mean the forward bed. There's your air conditioning control. And then back here you have your uh, little bit aft bed here. Here's your control panel. This is your 120 volt, which is basically power coming from the street or the generator. Okay. This is your uh, waste uh, meter. Okay. And then here you have your generator start and stop. You got your microwave. This is just like storage, storage. This is your fusion radio control head. And some, uh, I guess your DVD player and items like that. I'm not sure if I showed you the head already, but here it is. Okay. Very nice. Uh, looks like no one's used it. Look at the floor. No scuffs, no scrapes. And this is just storage. This is where this goes. And then these cushions are some filler cushions for the outside. We'll make our way back. So this is some fender storage. So you put four fenders in there. And then this is your uh, mechanical space. So it looks like they have a, I'm not sure what the table's for. It could be like for the beach or something. Here's your teak uh, bow table batteries batteries generator i cr crawled all through that area there it's all clean kosher nothing to uh, be concerned with that is your transducer so in this in this part we're good those are your rods for your uh sunshade that looks like it clips in right back here i'm not sure if the front has but um that's what those rods are for and here's your sunshade material, uh, storage cover, and this is the lid for the grill. So basically, those black rods pop into these sockets, and then that awning clips onto the roof on the top side. And uh, let's see if the front has it. We'll see here. Yep. Whoops, sorry, I almost fell. So yes, the front also has a sunshade in the front. So yep, she's a pretty boat. Um, all that she is, all that they said she was. And uh, right here, that's where that's, that awning clips in.
So uh, call me if you have any questions. And um, yeah, she's ready. Thank you.